And our house is now complete. It looks awesome. Yeah, but um, so what is that over there? Whoa, is that a wither skeleton's head? What is that doing over here? This is so weird. I hope there's not a giant monster in there. What? There is totally not a giant monster. Now, oh. guys, there's a giant monster in here. His name is Baby Mutant. Oh. Wait, if it's a baby, that means it's going to get bigger. Oh, no. And wait a minute. He's already taller than me. So that means when he becomes a full mutant, he's going to be 10 times bigger than me. Everyone run out. Oh. Mutant wither skeletons are crazy powerful. They have a ginormous sword and a wooden house is not going to protect us. Let's add lava around our house to protect it. But wait, Luke, the wither skeleton is another mob. He loves lava. We have to add water. They hate water. Let's place it all around the house. All right, race you. I'm going to start on this side and you start on that side. Let's go. I'm going to beat you. No way. I'm a way quicker water placer because it's blue and I'm blue and it's giving me the powers of speed and I'm already on the corner. Now it's time to turn inside. I'm going to be the judge of that. Oh, Luke, who's in the lead? Who's in the lead? You're in the lead right now, but Roxy's catching up. Oh, no. Roxy, slow down. Hey, slow down, please. Nope, I'm not slowing down. I'm going fast. What? Oh, no. And I finally made it to the last corner. Roxy, it's over. I'm going to reach the middle first. Uh, no, I am. No way. It's already too late. I reached the middle with my water. Let's go. Roxy, you turned in too soon. Uh, oh, my gosh. Roxy, are you serious? Now we have to adjust it. Sorry, I was going fast. Ohms, we have a problem. What? A problem? What's the problem? We have the water mount. Our house is safe. Let's go. He could just jump over it. Oh, I did not think about that. Oh, gosh, he could just jump over it. Oh, no, oh, no. We need more powerful and deadly dangerous weapons. We're going to use end crystals, and we're going to need some obsidian for this. Everyone, follow me. We're making end crystal traps all in the front, but be very careful because, like, if you walk into one of these, it makes a big explosion. Yeah. We do not want to blow up anything. Exactly. We just want to blow him up. So set up a bunch of end crystal traps. He's going to get destroyed, baby. Oh, yeah. This wither skeleton's got nothing on us. That's what I'm saying. And whoa, our front lawn looks um a little bit insane. This is crazy. Holmes, I kind of want to try it out. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, don't try it out. I think it's about to make like a chain reaction. If we hit one of them, they're all going to activate. So um, stay away please uh, that's it i'm going in survival i want to try it no luke and oh my gosh it worked it activated all of them around it guys what did i just say sorry Ohms. i just needed to try it oh my gosh luke you are crazy we have to have the trap for the wither skeleton and good thing we know it works because it one shot you and there's literally a million of them roxy you're placing so many yeah i placed at the front so when he walks out he's gonna Genius, really smart thinking. Let's play some more here, and we should be good on the end crystals here. And boom, I'm done. Wow, we have a whole army of crystals. Ohms, have you heard of TNT minecarts? Oh, yeah, we should make a TNT minecart trap. And we could even use some of the modded TNTs. How much TNT power do we want? It needs to be something super powerful. Well, there's two options I'm really thinking of. How about the arrow TNT or the lightning TNT minecart? Which one should we try? Can we try them out first? All right, let's test it out over here so we can see how much damage we're working with. Let's grab some rails and make a mini roller coaster like this. Perfect. Now, if we push the minecart, it should explode. Oh my Gosh, that was insane. Oh. That was like a billion arrows. Let me try. All right, here. Take the minecart. I'm going to look at it from a bird's eye view. Activate it. Let me just place it down and push it. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, that was insane. I love that one. Try the lightning one. All right, Luke, here. Take the lightning minecart and push it. I need to see a bird's eye view of this, too. Let's see which one is cooler. Go. This one's going to be awesome. And oh, my my gosh, my ears! It hurts so much! Ah, what is happening? Oh, uh, my ears are ringing. Me too! Uh, Luke is above face! Uh, Luke is above face! Oh my gosh, do you hear that? Yeah, where's 
that coming from? Luke is a pop face. Luke is a pop face. Uh, hey, you're saying it. Up top, dude. Yeah, you got me. But which one should we use, guys? All in favor of using the arrow stand over here and all in favor of using the lightning stand over here. Let's use the arrow. Whoa, all of you guys want the arrow mine cards? All right, let's make a trap with the arrow mine cards. Um, do you even know how to make a trap? Of course I do. I'm a professional. So let's go inside and we're going to make the mine card shooter right over here. So let's build a little staircase up like this. Make it reach to the outside and make it go super duper ooper schmooper high up. About here should be a good height. So then it's going to drop and it's going to fall down right here. The arrows are gonna go everywhere. So let's put the powered rails all down over here like that all the way until we reach inside the house. Perfect. Now let's grab a lever and activate them all and let's test it out. So let's put the mine card down and give it a push and does it work? Wow! Guys, I might have broken some of the end crystals, but the arrow shooters work! But now we have to fix all of that. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry guys, but note to self, do not use the arrow shooters until after all the end crystals are destroyed. While we fix this arrow shooters. Ooh, great idea. Okay, so the first one is an arrow one over here, and how about we add a lightning one next to it so we can have both? That's gonna be awesome. Let's do it. So let's go down and let's do it on this side. And wait, since this is the lightning one, let's make it out of gold blocks and let's build up like that. Go all the the way above ground and make it the same height so let's build up to here perfect then let's build over and up and now we have to put the rails down so let's go down all the way back into the house with all of our powered rails perfect then let's power it with the lever and we should be good to go so let's place it down oh my gosh guys guys it's broken oh gosh oh gosh it activated too soon oh my gosh my ears my ears I am so sorry. No, oh, gosh. Ohms, you just broke more of the crystals. I'm sorry. I don't know why it activated inside that house. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I think we need a new design. Let me extend it going down this way. Then extend the rails down over here. And does it do the same thing? Nope. So now if we push it down, it should be good. Okay. It activates a little early, but it still works. It's defending the outside of our house. Include that one. It's breaking more crystals. Oh, sorry, Roxy. Uh, the, wow. That's the third time. All right. I said I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Ooms, how about we add some dynamite shooters? Ooh, great idea. And there's a bunch of dynamites to choose from. Which one should we try? Which one is the best? Hmm, let's see. I mean, there's a bunch of options. Is there anything that could destroy a mutant wither skeleton? How about a snow dynamite to slow him down? Ooh, let's test it out. Snow dynamite, what do you do? Oh, it makes everything turn to snow. That makes sense. That's trash. We need something good. What about the freeze dynamite? Oh, yeah. Does it freeze? Lily, are you frozen? No, I can walk. Oh, my gosh. This is trash. It just makes ice. That's doo-doo. Ohms, what about the erupting dynamite? Let's see what this does. And wait, what? Guys. Oh, no. I think that was a mistake. Whoa. It spawned in some TNTs. And <gasps> that is awesome. Should we use this, guys? I don't know. It might blow us up. Oh, yeah. I don't want to kill any of you guys. No, that's dangerous. We need something that's not that dangerous. What about a withering dynamite? It's perfect for a wither skeleton. Let's try it out first. All right. Here yeah. And oh, my gosh. It made everything into soul sand. And wait a minute. Soul sand makes the ground hard to walk on. Look at how slow I'm moving. The arms, it spawned in wither skeletons. Wow, we don't want to give them back up. Kill the skeletons. Ooms, what about the ocean dynamite? Oh, yeah, because he's weak to water. Let's test this thing out. If we throw it, it <gasps> makes a whole ocean. That is awesome. But we have to use that after the lightning minecart and the arrow minecart because water is going to make everything super messy. So let's go over here, grab some blue concrete blocks, and build up three layers like that. 
<laughs> then grab some dispensers and put three of them pointing this way and fill them all up with some ocean dynamite. And we're not going to test this out because I do not want to mess up the hydro crystals. Me neither. Oh, sorry, Roxy. I know you worked really hard on that. Now, let's go down and let's make a staircase so we can connect them to some redstone and then make it lead all the way inside of the house so we can access it from here. Now, let's connect our redstone dust all on top of all the blue blocks and over here on the top let's use some repeaters to connect it to each dispenser and now the water dispenser shooter is ready all we need to do is add a lever and we're not testing it out it's only going to be tested out when we need to use it oh, how about we add some laser security that is a great idea let's go to all the corners and go to the outside and set up some laser security i'll race you to the other side roxy see you later uh. no i'm the best laser placer no you are not i am you're going down i'm already so far ahead of you see you later slow poke yeah slow poke. Yeah, yeah, that's what they all say. I'm going mega fast right now. Oh, I'm at the back. What? Slow down, Roxy. I'm coming right now. You're going down. I'm placing so quick. Oh, gosh, I'm messing up. I'm messing up. Go, go, go. I gotta get to the middle before you. I'm catching up. Wait, why you're catching up? Oh gosh, you're already here. Oh no, oh no, I gotta make it to the middle. And wait a minute, is it a tie? I think so. All right, fine. I'm fine with it being a tie, but whoa, our laser defense system looks super secure. Ohms, can he just jump over it? Doesn't he have super jump? Oh yeah, you're right. Mutant wither skeletons do have super jump. We need something on the inside. And I know exactly what. We need to get some security guards. Look kind of security guards some super powerful ones so first over here let's make a ginormous fence like that and connect it awesome then we have to go on the inside and grab some iron blocks and pumpkins and do you know what i'm doing i think so let me take a guess take your guess what am i doing i think you're making an iron golem Yep, you got it. We're making iron golem security guards. So let's make a T and place the pumpkin head on top. Awesome. We have the first guard. That's going to be mine. Then we can make one for Luke. Luke, what are you naming him? Jerome. Jerome. Okay, well, mine is Michael. Michael, Jerome, then Roxy. What are you going to name your guy? Mine is going to be named Super Iron Golem. Well, you just added Super in front of his name, but okay. And Lily, what should we name yours? I want to name mine Princess P. Ooh, okay. Let's make Princess P. And oh my gosh, excuse me, Super Iron Golem. I'm trying to spawn in your sister. And whoa, we all have them. But Ohms, I can't tell who's who. What? This one is obviously Jerome. And then this one is Super Iron Golem. Then this one is Princess P. And oh gosh, I already lost track. We need to give them names. Let's use anvils to name them. Oh, great idea. Let's put an anvil down and grab a name tag and we have to name all the names the first one is super iron golem so roxy name your guy super iron golem there you go the next one is jerome and luke how do you spell jerome okay it's o-m-z wait what uh, okay o-m-z i-s-a-b-u-t-t-f-a-c-e wait what um luke i think you just spelled a word it says ohms is a butt face. Uh, no! That's how you spell Jerome. Here, it's like that. There you go. This is Jerome. Put it on your guy. And then, Lily, what was yours? Princess P. All right, Princess P. And mine was... I forgot his name. I'm just going to name him Ohms Jr. Now, let's put the name tags. Wait, what? what's going on here? Why is Ohms Jr. standing on top of this guy? And who is this guy? It's Super Iron Gold. Oh my gosh, they're on a stack on top of each other. Whoa, we have a mega security guard. Awesome. This wither skeleton has no chance. I know, right? But guys, there's some room over here and I know what we could put. What's it gonna be, Ohms? We're gonna make a ginormous powerful arrow tower shooter because a mutant wither skeleton uses a sword. So if we use arrows, we could shoot them down. So let's build it out with this shape. And now everything. 
everyone, help me build up. I'm going to need all hands on deck because this is going to be a giant build. And we're going to build all the way up to this level. And the structure is now complete. And wow, this is ginormous. Now let's make a little platform on the inside over here like this. Perfect. And we need to grab some bars because I don't want any of you guys falling off. That would be terrible. You would probably break both your feet. Perfect. Now we need to grab a chest and put some bows in this bad boy. So let's put it right here. Grab some bows. And I'm going to fill this chest up all with a billion bows so you guys can take one for yourself. Then next to it, I'm going to add some arrows. And whoa, there's so many arrows to choose from. Which one should we use? How about slowness arrows? Oh, yeah, great idea. Slowness arrows is gonna slow them down a bunch. So let's fill up this chest with some slowness arrows. But we have no way to get down. We have to build some ladders coming up. So let's break a hole over here and break an entrance. Then let's grab some ladders and wait a minute. Oh gosh, we have to make the entrance here so then we can climb up the ladders here. Perfect. Now let's go all the way to the top with ladders. Awesome. Now our arrow tower is complete. That was super duper easy and if we want to jump down quick we can just jump into the water and attack it with our weapons what weapons are you talking about we don't have anything oh yeah you're right we need to get some armor and weapons everyone follow me and oh gosh there's no room in the house because all of these paths with our blocks but that gives me a great idea let's make an underground bunker so everyone help me out let's make a room in here and boom the room is now complete now we have to add our secret armor! Ohms, check this out! Ah! Oh my gosh! What the heck is that? I, I already know it's you. Why'd you do that? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, what even is that? There's a whole mutant wither skeleton armor set. Whoa, really? Let me check this out. And oh my gosh, this set is awesome. Let me put it on. And whoa, I look super duper scary. Look, his sword's even here. Wait, whoa, is that the mutant wither skeleton sword? Awesome. And does it have any abilities? I think so. Let me try it out. Whoa. Oh, it does. That's awesome. Let me grab it. And it does nine hole attack damage. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. And hey, yo. Whoa. It does an awesome ability. It shoots out lasers. Let's make an automatic armor dispensary with this. I got this corner over here. Well, I got this corner this corner. And I got this one. So to make an automatic armor, you guys already know, place the dispensers all around you like that. Then put all your armor in each dispenser like this. Perfect. Then on the one underneath, put your weapon. Then put a fence in the middle and a pressure plate on top. So now when you walk into it, boom, you get the full set instantly. Wait, Ohms, if the armor is this powerful, imagine how powerful the mutant with her skeleton is. Oh my gosh, she's probably way more powerful. Oh no, everyone to the surface. But wait, there's no way to get out. We need to get some ladders and build out of here. Phew, we're out, we're out, we're out. But what do we do, Luke? How can we fight something that powerful? We need a self-destruct button. Wait, great idea. And what if we made it a custom TNT? And I know exactly what to use. We're going to use the withering TNT. I don't know what it does, but we're gonna make a self-destruct button out of that. The first thing we need to do is grab a button and put it right over here. Now let's grab some redstone torches and put it behind the button. Now we have to make a redstone elevator all the way a billion blocks up high. Ohms, don't you think what we're doing is a little dangerous? What? What do you mean it's dangerous? It's just a super deadly dangerous TNT that we're gonna spot a billion of. That's gonna blow up our whole house. We don't know know that right guys is it gonna blow up our whole house roxy what do you think i agree with luke well we're already doing it anyways because the elevator is complete now let's test out the button roxy hit the button down there let's see if it activates this torch okay i'm gonna hit it right now and it works awesome all right turn it off because now it's time to add all the tnt so the first step is to make a layer of normal blocks right here and make it the same size as our house so we can self-destruct if it comes down to it oh no i hope we don't have to blow up our house yeah me too but if we do it's gonna be awesome and this is a good size let's fill it in 
in. Perfect. We have the platform. Now let's grab some redstone and make a full layer of our redstone above it. Go, 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 go. I'm placing it so fast. Well, I'm placing it faster. Yeah. I'm the fastest. No, you're not. I am. Boys, let's be for real. I'm the fastest placer. Oh, my gosh. But now uh, the redstone is set. And all that's left is to put withering TNT all underneath these. Look crazy dangerous. They don't even look like TNT. It just has a wither skeleton skull on them. Oh, my gosh. I'm a little bit nervous. But let's go all around and place it. And boom. We have a full layer now. Above, we have to add some redstone repeaters. Because if we don't, the signal is not going to reach. And it's only going to put like half of the TNT. And that should be just enough. Now, we have to hook up the redstone torch elevator to the redstone up over here. So, let's place a redstone behind the torch and a repeater and that should be perfect now once we hit the panic button it's gonna activate all the weather tnt but wait we have to protect it in glass because this is super deadly dangerous so let's grab some red glass and make an entire security area for the button perfect it's now secured uh, ohms we haven't checked on the wither skeleton oh yeah you're right he might have mutated oh gosh everyone to the armory we're gonna check on him let's go down to our secret basement. And let me put my full set of armor on. And wow, I look awesome and I'm prepared for battle. You and Wither Skeleton, you're going down. But Ohms, if we use the emergency TNT, how are we going to escape? Oh gosh, I did not think about that. We need an escape plan. We need a way to ride out of here. Follow me, guys. Let's go up over here. And since the button is here, we need an escape route right next to it here. So let's grab a mini bus and put it right over here in the back. Perfect. This could fit all of us. And we're going to have to break some lasers over here for us to fit through and add a bridge underneath like that. So now we could drive out of here and escape it. Oh my gosh, this looks so silly. There's four wither skeletons in a minivan. Ohms, this is super goofy. I know, right? But wait, we have to check up on the wither skeleton. So everyone, follow me. Ohms, I think he escaped. Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, I see him. Everyone charging. Whoa. Oh, he looks crazy. I'm going for his butt. Go, go, go. Get the butt. Wait a minute. We could use our ability to activate the crystals. Guys, lure him over here. I'm going to use the crystals, okay? Okay, I'm doing it. Come over here, you big smelly skeleton. And he, oh, gosh, wait. Oh, I hit the crystal. Did it do damage? No, he looks fine. He looks super scary, not just fine. Oh my gosh, take this. Take my sword. Yeah, attack with your abilities, guys. Okay, I'm hitting. Go, go, go. He's so strong. Oh my gosh, careful, guys. Hey, leave my friends alone, you big bully. Die. And whoa, guys, he has hops. He's jumping so high. And, oh gosh, my sword just broke. I'm dead. Oh, no, this is bad. Holmes, let's go to the arrow tower. All right, quickly, everyone retreat to the arrow tower and grab a bow and boom him down. Let's get a bow and a bunch of slowness arrows. And he's still outside. Hey, oh, gosh, I'm missing all my shots. Move, Roxy. I got to get him. And oh, my gosh, who has a flame bow? Me. Oh, of course you have a flame bow. You love fire, but whoa, he's jumping so high. And wait a minute. He just jumped over the lasers and <gasps> over the water. Oh, no. Oh, no, Holmes. Look what he's doing to the golems. Oh, hey, leave our golems alone. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh, guys, this is bad. Leave them alone, you big bully. Putting them stuck like that was a bad idea. Oh, gosh. Everyone go down. We have to protect them. Let's go. Holmes, I think it's too late. No. He killed all of our security. And oh my gosh, he's super intimidating. Okay, guys, here's the plan. Roxy, you continue fighting him. I'm going to use the mine cars, all right? Okay, I'm ready. First, let's use the arrow mine car. And come on, work, please, please work. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that did so much damage. Yes, now let's use the lightning one. I'm running quickly and i'm pushing it oh my gosh it's off and whoa it's working it's doing so much damage him stay inside roxy stay inside it's dangerous out there i'm just shooting him with my bow 
Awesome it. Wait, what? He's still alive. Oh, gosh. Close the door. What else do we have? Wait, we could use our ocean shooter. Shoot the ocean. All right. Three, two, one. Here. And did it work? And oh, gosh, guys. It shot behind him. And ooh, some squid spotted. And ah, oh, my gosh. He does so much damage. Run inside. Oh, no. Luke, I think we ran out of options. And you just shot me. What do we do? We got to hit the emergency button. You're right. Okay, okay. Everyone in the minivan, quickly. I'm going to run into the driver's seat after I hit it, okay? Okay. All right, are you guys ready? I'm hitting it in five, four, three, two, one. And boom, I hit the button. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, I'm inside. Go, go, go. And oh, my gosh, it all spawned in. Yes. And is it going to work? Holmes, I'm lagging. And wait, what? I think it worked. Let's go check on him. All right. And wow, it made so many soul sand blocks and withered skeletons all around. And oh, yes, he died. We did it, guys. We killed the mutant wither skeleton. And that was an awesome adventure. And if you want to join us on our next click right here, bye. bye.